You can create and manage the database of the BP2100 on a computer. Use the retail utility to create a database on the computer. You can also use an Excel file for easy data management. In our demo, we show how to create a database of items on an Excel file. Start the retail utility by double-clicking its icon. Provide the password and click Continue. First, we will need to create a template Excel file for data entry by exporting one from the Retail Utility. To create a template, in the Retail Utility, choose Databases Item Management. The Item Management panel opens. First, click the Department button. Type the name of a department. Click Add. Click Apply. To add an item, start typing the item number in the Item Number field. Click the Next field. Type an item code. Click the Next field. Type the name of the item. Configure the base measurement unit from the drop-down. We enter sachet for the unit. Every item can have two types of base unit. For chili powder, we configure the second unit, that is item unit 2, as grams. For the unit 1 to unit 2 relationship, we enter 100. Think of each sachet of chili powder as having 100 grams of chili powder. Click the next field. Type the rate or cost. You can have up to three rates for each item, which may be applied selectively while billing. Key in the other two rates. Three taxes can also be set. Key in each tax rate one by one. You can add discounts as well. In this demo, we ignore the discounts stock value and cost price. Click Add Item. The item is added to the database. Continue to add a few more items so that the other base units such as kilogram and bottles can be covered. Once done, click the Export to Excel icon. Provide a name such as template.xls and save it without password protection. When you are asked whether you wish to save it with a password, click No. Open the Excel file. You can enter data into the template to complete your item database. Once done, save the Excel file with a fresh name. In the Retail Utility Item Management panel, click the Import from Excel file. Choose the saved Excel file and click Open. The completed database now gets imported. You may now save as a configuration file or send the database to the printer.